there is a peace that passes all understanding. Having millions of dollars and still yet you are discontented with yourself. It's not everybody have financial problem. And it's not everybody sickly. And it's not everybody need a house. It's not everybody need a car. Some person, it's not everybody need a companion. So everybody problem or everybody need is different. But God will meet you at the point of your need. And he brought you to that place because there is something that God has for you that you are going to receive here where you would not get elsewhere. At just where it is the time, timing, and the season. Because don't mango have a set season? Guinea have a set season? Okay. So when your season come, nothing can hold you back. When your season come to bloom and to blossom and to bear, hey, nothing can stand in your way. And you're going to say, it is my time. And I'm going to receive all that God has in store for me. I've waited so long. I've been to this place. And I've wondered and I've questioned and said, God, what is my purpose? But I stayed. And as I saw, um, it was the, um, Job said, they that wait upon the Lord. You got to learn how to wait. You got to wait upon the Lord and you shall renew your strength. Isaiah said you shall mount up with wings like eagle. You came in here limping. You came in here broke. You came in here depressed. You came in here sad. You came in here discouraged. But God is going to cause you to mount up. You're going to come out of here leaping up like an eagle. Mounting up. You're going to send far above the clouds. You're going to go places in God and receive and experience the supernatural like you have never known it before. And I'm telling you, you shall not die until everything that God has promised you come to pass in your life. Every places that God tell you you will travel, you will go there and the hand of death dare not touches you. And the enemy, no accident, no accident Accident. I come against accident in the name of Jesus. The spirit of delay can only work for such a time. But when God said it's time and it is over, God said when whatever is speak must come to pass. When God said it is enough is enough. When God said it is over, it is over. It is your time and it is your season. Go forth beyond these open doors. There's a new and fresh anointing. Hear the spirit calling you. Ah, oh, to come. Hallelujah. And as you move, as the spirit of God woo you. And as the spirit of God directs you. He has brought you safely thus far. You're at the right place. You're at, in the presence of God. And he has placed. The prophet is the mouthpiece of God. He speaks for God. The mouth is a very important part of the body. I don't care how you're beautiful. I don't care how you're handsome. I don't care how you're attractive. If you can't speak, then there's a big part of your life gone. But the mouth is important because it communicates your desires. It communicates your passion, your dreams. The mouth speaks. The mouth articulates your thoughts. And so the mouth is very vital. And so the prophet is the mouthpiece of God. <laughs>